All right. So here's our, our UPV audio analyzer. It's been around since about 2006, I believe, 2005, 2006. It's uh, best in class uh, audio analyzer designed for a number of applications. It's really research and development. We use it in hearing aid testing. We use it in communications testing. Anyone who's doing high quality audio testing uh, for the wireless market, we use it there as, as well. But again, it's a higher priced product and best in class. Well, we wanted to introduce a new low cost analyzer for uh, pr product production and for the Pro-AV community, and that's the UPP. The UPP has been around for about a year, but the new HDMI interface, which is this portion up here, was introduced just recently. When I say just recently, I mean this is actually directly from our lab in Munich. We're not shipping yet, we're shipping in about three weeks. So, what's unique about this is number one, it's a low cost platform. It starts at around $9,900, which is quite unusual again for Rook Schwartz. But what's also unique about this platform is it supports up to eight channels of analog audio on the bottom. It supports consumer and professional digital interfaces on the top, both optical and copper. Uh, in this case, the HDMI, we have source and sync, signal and analysis, basically. And what makes this product quite special is the fact that not only are we testing the audio, we're also testing the video. So in addition to the traditional audio measurements, we actually have a video sync pattern, which you can see on the screen behind you. And we're the only analyzer on the market that offers a moving video test pattern, which is a big deal. Because when you're testing HDMI, everyone, everyone thinks, I'm gonna test the audio, or I'm gonna test the video. They're hand in hand. HDMI carries both content on one piece of coax, or one piece of copper, so to speak. So we test both simultaneously. And we support up to eight channels of simultaneous test on HDMI as well as eight channels of simultaneous test, complete parallel testing on analog. We're fully HDMI 1.4a compliant, and that was our first segue into the market, is a 1.4a compliant device. So we wanted to make sure that we came out of the gates right up to speed with the current technology that we are.